up for a new challenge? No problem. Come on down to Big Man's. This bow right here actually reminds me of a story that's very uh, near and dear to my heart. My good buddy Robin Hood, he came in down one day and, you know, he's been a buddy for quite a while. He was telling me he's starting to get serious with old Maid Mary. And he's thinking about popping the question, but needed a ring to get the job done. And he noticed we had a few nice ones here at the shop. And I said, okay, no problem, Robin. You know, I'll help you out the best we can, you know. But what do you got in collateral? He said, well, I got this old bow here, and I'm just getting out of the whole bow thing. It's not me anymore, you know. It's time to get serious. I said, all right, no problem. I like the bow. But uh, in order to take it, I got to test it. So, you know, after work, I met him down over at the Sherwood Forest Bar and Grill. And, uh, you know, we had a good time. Coming out of the bar, we noticed here comes the beast peeking out of the forest, staring right at us. I said, whoa, Robin, hold on. Here's my shot. He said, Chris, that's a shot of a lifetime. Don't miss it. So I drew back. Ah. Right between the eyes. Down goes the beast. Down goes Frazier. And uh, needless to say, that was the only convincing I needed to take the bow. And I brought the beast down to show you guys today. Ah. Ah. This guy right here. Don't let the size fool you. That rifle was loaded at the time. Now, if you come down to the store, I'm not going to tell you where he's at. You find the beast of the forest, the Sherwood Forest Bar and Grill, mention him, get 10% pawn. Thank you.